Hi, my name is Keith Jacobs, and I'm the new Science, Technology, Engineering, and Math, or STEM Extension Specialist here at the Illinois 4-H State Office, and I'm excited to announce the 2017 Robotics Challenge taking place Saturday, May 6, 2017, at the Orr Building on the Illinois State Fairgrounds in Springfield. This year's theme is inspired by healthy living and will require teams to engineer robots or health bots that will perform tasks related to healthy living and making healthy choices. For this challenge, any commercially available or homemade robot may be used, and any material may be used in the construction of the robot and the field. This is also your opportunity to be creative in designing your field and robot. Teams must consist of at least three youth with a maximum of 10 youth aged 8 through 18. The playing field is a standard first Lego league table constructed using 4 foot by 8 foot sheets of plywood and 2 by 4 walls. All robots must start out touching one of the four table walls. This year, teams can have a maximum of two robots running simultaneously. However, only one mo robot may be scoring points at a time. In addition, robots must be separated by at least four feet at the start of the event. The robots will have three minutes to complete their program task. Once the robots and time have started, human team members cannot touch any of the robots or anything on the field. Teams will incur a technical penalty each time they contact the robot or directly influence its path. Each technical penalty removes 10% of a team's total score with a maximum of five penalties. Depending on the time available, teams may have one or two practice runs before their actual real run. And as usual, no remote controls will be allowed. So teams, be clever in your design and strategy for this challenge. This year's theme is Healthy Living, so each of the Health Bot's missions have been broken down into five different categories. First, Decoration. Two, Making Healthy Choices. Three, My Plate. Four, Mental Health. And five, Environmental Health. Number one, Decorations. So decorate your robot as your favorite healthy food, activity, etc. This is your opportunity to score easy points while being creative on how you represent your team and your Health Bot. Making Healthy Choices. A major part of healthy living is making sound health decisions. In this challenge, your health bot will use its sensors to detect and avoid unhealthy choices or items in the field. Examples could be cigarettes or unhealthy snacks. Teams are encouraged to explore a variety of unhealthy activities that their robot can avoid. Points will be awarded per unhealthy choice avoided, with more points being awarded per unhealthy choice placed in the garbage. Sleep. Getting adequate rest is essential for good health. In this task, you will receive points if your robot stops on a bed and parks for five seconds or takes a nap. You will receive more points if your robot parks on the bed at the end of the match. Each robot can only do this task once. MyPlate. Choose MyPlate.gov is a USDA website that offers ideas and tips to help you create healthier eating styles that meet your individual needs and improve your health. In this task, your health bot will assemble a MyPlate as depicted on the MyPlate website, www.choosemyplate.gov. Food items must be picked up one at a time and delivered to the MyPlate assembly point separately. In other words, a robot must pick up a protein item, deliver it to MyPlate, then get a dairy item and deliver it to the MyPlate and so on. To be successfully delivered, any part of the food item must be within the designated region of the plate. Points will be awarded for each food item successfully delivered if the food and plate are on the robot table. More points will be awarded for each food item successfully delivered if the food and plate are on the table in a refrigerator or any type of pantry that is at least 4 inches above the robot table surface. Bonus points will be awarded if the team allows the judge to randomly place the food item in one of five designated areas, allowing teams to demonstrate their use of sensors to be able to identify food objects. Additional bonus points will be awarded if a food item that the judge randomly places is an unhealthy item that the robot actually avoids. Bonus points will be awarded if the assembly of MyPlate has all five items and is assembled as depicted by the official MyPlate logo. Exercise. Exercising is an important element for maintaining a healthy lifestyle. These tasks are broken down into muscle strengthening, aerobics, and bone strengthening. Muscle strengthening as demonstrated by weightlifting. In this task, points will be awarded per ounce that the robot lifts a total distance of 4 inches as measured from the starting point of the lift to the ending point of that lift. Aerobics. 
In this task, your health bot will jog either the length and or the width of the table. Robots must contact the walls at each end of the run. Points will be awarded if the robot can jog the width of the table, with more points being awarded if the robot can jog the length of the table. Bone strengthening as demonstrated by playing soccer. In this task, your health bot will score a goal from a variety of points on this field. Your health bot can score a goal from each location only once unless the ball is retrieved by a second robot. Points will be awarded if the robot scores a goal less than 6 inches, with more points being awarded if the robot scores a goal between 6 inches and 12 inches, and even more points awarded if the distance is greater than 12 inches at your robot scores a goal. Mental Health Gift Giving Gift giving is an important way to promote a positive mind frame while practicing generosity and compassion. In this task, Robot 1 will deliver a gift to Robot 2 that is not initially contacting Robot 1. Points will be awarded if the gift is on the floor and Robot 1 delivers it close to Robot 2 and Robot 2 goes and picks it up. More points will be awarded if Robot 1 brings the gift to Robot 2 and both are contacting the gift after it is delivered. And even more points will be awarded if Robot 1 picks up the gift from a location then places the gift on Robot 2. Before delivering the gift to Robot 2, however, both robots must be in contact with the gift simultaneously when the gift is delivered, and the gift is not touching Robot 1 after it has been delivered. Cheering Encouragement from a friend or teammate provide positive feedback that help support a healthy lifestyle. In this task, robots may cheer in any way they can by making noise, spinning in circles, or making arm motions or doing a dance. Points will be awarded for robots randomly cheering other robots. More points will be awarded if the cheers are either synchronized or if Robot 1 cheers Robot 2 while Robot 2 is performing a task. Psychological. Keeping a clear head and a sharp mind are super important in maintaining a healthy lifestyle. In this task, your robot will return books to the library. Points will be awarded for this task if the book is on the table surface and more points will be awarded if the book is picked up from a location above the table and delivered to the library above the table surface of the robot. And finally, the last section, environmental health. Vaccines. Vaccines not only protect you personally from harmful diseases like mumps, measles, or rubella, but they also keep us safe as a population using something called herd immunity. In this task, your health bot will pick up vaccinations and deliver them to a nurse's office. Points will be awarded if the vaccine is on the robot table surface, with more points being awarded if the vaccine is picked up from a location above the table and delivered to the nurse's office above the robot table surface. Distribute winter clothing. During the winter months, it's very important to stay warm to prevent hyperthermia or complications like frostbite. In this task, your health bot will bring a scarf, boot, gloves, and or hat from the distribution center to the nurse's office, library, school, or second robot. Items must be delivered individually. Points will be awarded for each item delivered, with bonus points being awarded if all four items are delivered. Hurricane Flood Relief When natural disaster strikes, dedicated public health and public safety workers act as first responders to help those in need. In this task, your health bot will rescue miniature figures from the top of houses. Aggressively increasing points will be awarded for houses that are 3, 6, and 9 inches tall. Bonus points will be awarded per miniature figure if the robot takes the figure to the school. Asthma. It is well documented that pollution is a major contributing factor to the development of asthma. In this task, your health bot will install a scrubber on a smokestack. Smokestacks must be at least 12 inches tall with a maximum diameter of 3 inches. For more inspiration on healthy living and how you can incorporate healthy living into your health bot, please check out the Center for Disease Control and Prevention's website at www.cdc.gov forward slash healthy living. For more information on this challenge, including registration information, point values, and specific task requirements, please visit the Illinois Robotics Facebook page or visit the University of Illinois Extension State 4-H website at 4h.extension.illinois.edu. I'm Keith Jacobson. I look forward to seeing you and your team May 6th in Springfield. Thank you.